What's up guys? Beautiful day in New York. 40 some degrees and I thought I'd make a, a producer video about what I'm doing in my car today. Uh, so I've been working at this thing for about a week. So the so let me so let me show you what I'm doing right here. Um speed sensor. We are located back here. Right there. All right? It's just behind the uh, it's just behind the uh, the rotor and the shield and it's on the uh, on the knuckle steering so um, now you know traditionally the the way to do this is to remove everything because I did it on the driver's side when I have to do the uh, ball joint here at the bottom so this comes off this comes off this comes off, obviously the axle comes out, and then the ball joint in the bottom comes off. So, well, you know, in New York, I work on the streets, I don't have a, a garage, I have family in Jersey, and um, so this, this ABS light went on, and then it's been out, it's been out for a while, I haven't been able to get done to it, because I have kids, and family work, and all that stuff, so I did this without removing any of my components because I've already done the steering, inner steering rod, the rod and the outer and I'm not going to remove this, 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 or this, or the brakes because everything will come off and this, I know it'll work, okay, for all you mechanics out there, your, your pros, semi-pros, you know what I'm talking about I'm not making this shit up, so here's how I did this, okay Obviously, I peeled them all off. Pop. Took them all off on the line. All the way up through the hole. Where's the hole? Right over there, right? And it comes out from the uh, inside the engine. It, it, mind you, this causes, uh, you know, uh, problems in the long run if you don't take care of it right away. But it's, it, So the labor alone for this thing would probably be at least four or five hours. So, <sighs> drill. pick and yeah, so the drill bits and just a lot of time and patience so this is what came out this is the last piece this is the bottom piece of it right there see how I drill the hole through it gently as possible you want to clean up the area that you're working on you want to clean this area you don't want to damage the bolt the screw hole so you want to clean an area because down beneath this is simply just the axle and ABS really just monitors and measures the speed of how fast the uh, axle is turning the wheel so I bought a new part here's a new part right here this is for the driver's side so it's longer the driver's side is shorter so here's what I mean right and I'm gonna insert this thing right here See? Bam. Close. Look at that. Beauty, huh? Beauty. So without removing everything, it's, it can be done. It can be done, but you have to have a lot of patience and hand skills. Um, and the weather. If you don't have a garage like me, I work at the back of my, uh, my job. I work in an auto zone or my uncle's house in the driveway on the street. So this ABS system really gave me a car a problem. And you know you get a lot of uh jerking motion and you know tire that's been affected. So you might hear a little creaking here and there and you might think it's any of your components, but it's not. So it's just ABS. I've done my uh little research on it, but this job can be done without removing all the components. Okay, you just gotta have a good set of uh, drill bits, all of the largest ones, you can tell I've, I use them appropriately and accordingly, you don't want to damage the actual, you know, the hole where, where the ABS is going to go, because you're replacing that, if it doesn't fit, then you screw it, so you gotta be gentle with it. So, like I said, um, I'll just use the smallest drill bit I had to go in there gently, nice and smooth until it goes in. And I started just rocking it, rocking it, rocking it until, until that last piece came out. Um, 
So, you know, you got any questions, you let me know. Send me a message. And um, I'm sure I'll learn something from you guys. I'll learn from everybody on, on the internet. Um, and, and then my, uh, I also read the manual. So, again, this is the ABS job without removing any of the steering or suspension components, brakes, hardware. Everything has to come off. And I mean everything. You know what I mean? And I know what it's like. It, it took me four or five hours to get it done. So you get this ping, ping, ping. All that thing has got to come off. The brakes. So ABS without removing anything can be done. On a Honda. Okay, I don't know about, you know, Europeans are a bit more complicated, but so it's just for now. Okay?